I'm Ann Lady McDivitt, and I'm the Digital Humanities Librarian at the University of Alabama, and I run the Alabama Digital Humanities Center. The Alabama Digital Humanities Center is a physical space in Gorgas Library, but it's also a service that we provide. And so one of the important parts of the ADHC is I want it to be a collaborative process. I want people to feel okay experimenting because that's what digital humanities is always going to be. The Alabama Digital Humanities Center has two different types of projects. Uh, one is pedagogical projects and the other is research projects. Usually with the pedagogical projects, that is when a faculty member uses the ADHD to create websites or digital tools in order to support their classes. And the other is a research project where the faculty member or students come to us and we teach them how to use digital tools and methods in order to support their research. We have over 50 projects with the ADHD that we've hosted or built. The most popular project that we have is the Mill Marginalia Project that looks at the Marginalia and the John Stuart Mill books at Oxford. And the project looks at the Marginalia of what John Stuart Mill has written, but also what students over the years have written in the margins at the library. You can see different thoughts over the years, whether they're John Stuart Mills or some random student from Oxford who decided they were gonna make a note in the book. I think the most representative pedagogical project that we've done is the Dirt Poor Project. And the Dirt Poor Project was looking at family members that lived during the Great Depression in the United States and also worldwide, and how they interacted with objects during the Great Depression, but also just what their everyday lives would be like. Uh, the Alabama Digital Humanities Center built a website to support that where they could display the content, they could map where their family members lived, and then they also have an object section where they can talk about something they would interact with daily. Currently, I'm really excited about a project that I'm working on with the English department and Cordelia Ross. Uh, we are actually working on building Beowulf with students in Minecraft so that they can understand the physical space of Beowulf and how important that is to the actual text. And it's great to see students just flying around in a creative mode to try and make dragons and buildings and try and recreate tombs. It's not something that I've ever done before and it's something that I really, really enjoy doing. If you're ready to engage with your students in classroom material in new and creative ways, or if you're looking for innovative and impactful methods to interpret your research and share it globally, you can contact us at adhc at lib.ua.edu to get started.